Have you ever wanted to try handcrafted fruit and vegetables with a dal curry centre? Or perhaps an apple smoothie whipped into a mousse and presented as an apple hanging on a tree? This week, the work of Otago Polytechnic Academics will be open to Auckland public in the form of an entirely man-made garden where even the soil is edible. Fruits and vegetables, uh, tomato, apple, pear, or, um, um, pumpkin and chilli. 2018 is going to be the year of the vegan. There's, there's no doubting about that. Big trends at the moment, uh, particularly in the States, is plant-based diets, uh, flexible diets, uh, vegan diets, but within there is this idea of convenience. We don't want to have to sacrifice things. We, 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 we don't want to handcuff ourselves to, to some kind of ideology which prevents us enjoying ourselves and being happy. Visitors will be able to sample nearly 4,000 edible products. The creative process involves working with natural products to design foods that look identical to fruit and vegetables but are filled with unexpected flavours. The hand moulded edible fruit and vegetable replicas are made from vegan white chocolate and so good milks. The garden opened to the Auckland public today and closes tomorrow. No word yet when the garden might come south. Roselle Le Bone, The South Today.